Hello again, everybody. This is Scott Hudgens and Mason. Hi. The Dodd RV, located in Yorktown, Virginia. Family owned and operated since 1956. We're doing the casual thing today. Um, we're also looking at a brand new 2020 Grand Design Reflection 367 BHS. Mid bunk, large living space, um, nice large master bedroom, washer dryer prep but the mid bunk is the highlight. We're in the mid room right now with the loft above us. Guys, do me a favor, watch to the end of the video. I'll show you a quick clip with the slide outs in, show you what you do and don't have access to. And Mason? Um, have a good time kids. Hope you like my video and my dad's video. We got lunch in the car and we're going to feed the ducks. <laughs> That's right. We're going to feed the ducks. So thanks again for watching. Please remember to give the thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button. Also the bell, the notification. It's on low too. It's on low too. That's right. And that will give you a heads up when new campers are being put on. And maybe we'll have some more with Mason's help. Thanks again for watching. Scott Hudgens and Mason. All right, starting here in the living area, you see the sofa in the back, opposing slides giving you the island, the pebble decor. Four door fridge. Uh, the highlight of the camper is the mid, uh, basically the mid bunk. So you've got a tri-fold sleeper sofa, as you come in, it's got your own basically room. You've got your own hanging area, a spot for a TV, uh, cable hookups, nice deep drawers, a little workstation, receptacles throughout. I'll show you a setup and breakdown of the trifold sleeper sofa. Also setting up the uh, mid bunk area, same thing. You got Velcro backs, pull from the bottom. Plenty of room inside for storage. You do have plenty of room to walk around about a foot at the end of the bed and room all the way around so you can move around this bed if you're trying to get out. Fold it back up. Slide the cushions back into place. Try fold sleeper sofa in the mid bunk. Going back to the living area. See the table and chairs. You do have an ottoman that has storage underneath the uh, ottoman. Pulls out. You got full storage inside it. You can also move it over in front of the sofa. And now you've got a footrest and storage right in front of the sofa. A couple different options for that bench right at the dinette area. And the backer is removable if you wanted to remove that, get a little bit more space. Chairs do have storage underneath as well. You've got a drawer underneath the table. Nice blackout shades. The Thomas Paine theater seating. Got a pull cord here, it does extend. You have heat, massage, LED lights. Cup holders, nice storage, overhead storage. In the back, another trifold sleeper sofa. A right, real quick setup and breakdown of the trifold sleeper sofa. Cushions do have the Velcro backs. Slide those out of your way. Pull from the bottom. Two legs pull out. You've got storage down here that those cushions will fit in. And then there's your bed. 
and then setting it back into the sofa. Very lightweight. Putting the two cushions back, and you're back in the sofa. Storage on either side, receptacles. Nice deep overhead storage. TV is on a swivel arm, so you can turn and get a better view from the sofa. Also, easily access the cable, receptacles, and hookups. Uh, hookups being over the top, you've got a CD, AM, FM, stereo, USB, Bluetooth, do have built-in speakers. Nice drawer. Drawers throughout. Large oven, three burner range. Pots and pans drawer down low. You do have a convection microwave oven. The islands, again, deep drawers. The best spot for your trash can. Large stainless steel sink. Spray head. In the kitchen area, got motion sensor lighting. Tons of storage. This is probably one of the bigger pantries you'll see. Four door gas electric refrigerator. Above the pantry, you do have more storage, tons of lighting, your thermostat controls for your max air fan. We did equip this with two air conditioners, so you have one in the living area, one in the master bedroom, both ducted in. Uh, you'll notice some shoes here, and above this mid bunk area you see the ladder and access to the top nice large sleeping area and we have mason who's being shy today we'll move on to the master bath good storage um, stepping up into the shower again i'm six five i'm right at the edge so i got probably another good two inches in here Vanity, moving into the master bedroom, we did a queen, storage underneath with shocks to hold it up. Windows do open on either side, there's that second AC we were talking about. Tons of storage, spot for a, another TV. Large closet. You have washer dryer hookup. Receptacles on both sides of the bed. USB. You see the ladder in use there. Going back down the side hallway. We're moving down into the living area. Great floor plan with this mid bunk. Still gives you a large living space. Brand new 2020 Grand Design Reflection 367 BHS. All right, moving to the outside. You see the nice reflection logo on the front. Nice 367 BHS. So if you're going down the road, it makes it easy to tell what you're looking at. So a nice addition there, storage and spot for your batteries up front, auto leveling control, uh, easy spot there for disconnecting, and then your main control panel here, uh, nice wide open clean storage, it is heated, your convenience area has got outside shower, your water hookup, your pool valves above the subfloor. And you can feed everything right through the bottom there 
uh, so you can keep this door shut and well insulated. Cable, 110, and then you've got motion sensor lighting on both sides. Magnetic latches, you've got your 30 pound LP bottle on one side and another one on the other. Your sewer hose storing tube there. Moving around the side. Factory installed ladder. Take a look at the roof. We're taking a look at the roof. You see the front AC, your skylights, TV antenna, rear AC, top of your slides. Your backup camera prep. We are looking at a 50 amp service. You do have two air conditioners. You do have a receiver on the frame there and your spare tire. A receiver, uh, 3,000 pound towing, 300 pound hitch weight. Check your local DMVs for tow ratings um, and actually the, the ability to tow each state is different. Uh, moving down the side, you see you have TV hookup on the outside. You do have an awning on the face of the slide out here, and then the larger one there as well. So two awnings gives you full patio area. Center support arm keeps that tube from sagging over time. LED lights, outside speakers. A uh, spot for a spray port so you can spray off the steps uh, or anything outside close to this outside kitchen area which is an electric refrigerator, charging area, receptacles, the other side of your storage again you can pass everything through, you got your battery disconnect, you got your pet leash holder there, your other 30 pound LP bottle, Nice thick compartment doors, slam latch, brand new 2020, brand design reflection, 367 BHS. All right, as promised, slide outs in. You do not have access to the living area. You will need to put this slide number two out. You do have access to get into the bathroom, to get into your bed, and you still have access to Mason up top.